And the final thing I wanted to show you was a moving thread the needle. Um, so we're going to go onto all fours. There's two different ways we can do this. We'll go onto all fours. Make sure that your wrists are underneath your shoulders and your knees are underneath your hips. We're going to take one hand, we're going to thread it through. We're going to get as low as we can onto the shoulder if we can, so the head's on the floor. Back up, and then you're going to take that elbow, follow it round with the head, up to the sky, and back down. And you can take it back straight through, up, take the elbow straight up. And to do that on the other side, just so you can see both sides, going straight through, onto the head or shoulder, bring it through, raise that elbow straight up, and look straight up. The other way that you can do it is just with your elbow. So if you have, for example, reduced mobility, or you can't get your head to the floor, you can just take your hand to a temple. You're gonna take your elbow to either your other elbow or your wrist, and then rotate that elbow straight up. So I have a bit of reduced mobility in this. I find it better to do that, but you can still get that rotation in the spine. So we're going down to the wrist or elbow and back up to the sky and just allowing the head to follow round and then repeat on the other side.